Uh, hello everyone, um, I'm just going to talk a bit about mouse sensitivity as I've seen this uh, thread coming up today and a lot of people talking about too high sense again and again. Um, so at first I just want to um, to, uh, to show you how I'm playing. I'm playing Counter-Strike since 2006 and I play with uh, DPI setting two number two on on my mouse which is 3600 dpi okay that sounds very high at first but the dpi itself doesn't mean anything okay except you, ha uh, you if you use like 50000 dpi which is most likely interpolated bullshit from your mouse which is not good but a lot of mice can nowadays can handle like uh 3000 dpi pretty well um so like if I had an in-game sense of 0 0.1, this would be considered low sense, I think. 0 0.1 and 3600 would be the same as 1 sense and 3, 000, uh, 360 dpi. Um, so I'm playing with um, an, well, an in-game sense of 1.9. So that's... 1.9 with uh, 3600 is a pretty high sense um, but I feel quite natural with it and you see um, I don't I don't have a, a webcam so I can't show you how far I'm moving my mouse but I'm generally uh, playing only from my uh, from my wrist I only move my wrist nothing else so but um, what I really wanted to talk about is how sensitivity and TPI work and so I set up this second um, the second profile on my mouse driver. So I got 90 DPI on my first setting. You see, it's I'm just moving my arm completely over my mouse pad right now, super slow. And the second DPI is my max uh, DPI, which is 5,670. And um, I will just show you the the differences with uh, the Zens that like, yeah, one by nine Zens is like uh, average Zens I think people use. So this is 90 DPI, okay. So I, this, this is literally unplayable. Um, this is 5,670 DPI. Now you, s I don't know if you can see it, but the mouse moves up and down a lot, or not a lot, but it seems like it's, it's jittering a bit up and down. But I can move it quite accurately, if I move my hand very slowly. Um, this jittering is coming from the mouse sensor, which is not very good at this 5600 DPI. You need like the newest mouse uh, sensors on the market, like the 3360 or 3366. Um, they can handle even higher DPI very well. Um, but like older sensors will will have a jittering uh, this high DPI, so I would not recommend that. Um, that's why I'm using 3600. Um, so, if I'm using a sensitivity with like 1, okay, I have 1 with 5000 DPI. This will still be considered high sense. I can play, I could play quite well with, with this, because I'm just, it still even seems a bit, a bit slow to me. But, I don't know it could be me. Um, so uh, as, as when you look at the crosshair, it moves pretty, pretty smooth. When I move my hand very slowly, just maybe a little bit of jittering, especially when I move move it faster, maybe. Um, but it's not too bad. Okay, you could play like this if you if you just like me only use your your wrist to move uh, the mouse. Um, on the other hand, if there are a lot of people that play with low uh, low DPI, sorry, with like 400 DPI or like 7, uh, 90 in this profile, okay? You will need like, I would need sev 76 in-game sensitivity for my effective DPI uh, with this DPI. Um, and as you can see, this is literally even more unplayable than with just the low DPI, because the in-game sense sense works differently okay it the in-game sense uh, will I, I don't know calculate the um, the 
how do you say it? The the angular uh I have no idea how this uh how this is called in English, so I'm sorry. Um like it calculates the angle that your mouse is moving. Okay? Uh or the parts of of an angle. Uh, of a degree, you know. Um so there are a lot of people that say like, oh I'm playing with seven sensitivity, okay? That have like high sense, okay? I mean I myself playing with very high sense, so um you, I'd say you can play with high sense, but look at the mouse, uh, the ma the crosshairs in it's moving. I don't know if if you can tell on the video, but if you put it on full screen, you can see it's like jumping two or three pixels when I'm moving. And seven is not even that high compared to like one hundred seventy or whatever. Uh, but that's pure bullshit. So that's why I say stay below three in-game sense because with three sensitivity, you can have. See the mouse, the crosshair is moving very smoothly, and even lower, like 1.9, as I'm doing, uh, having, it's it's just super smooth. Okay, um, and even if you have a high DPI, the DPI will not make you your crosshair skip pixels. It will maybe add a jittering or even some acceleration if your sensor is really bad. Um, so you have to figure that out at first, but um, my brothers. I would generally recommend if your mouse is capable capable of um, of a high DPI, use that high DPI to your advantage, so you can turn down your sensitivity even further to uh, the further uh, to the, the lowest value uh, that you can handle with your DPI on your mouse. So this is 0 0.1 sensitivity. This is like super smooth. This this feels like I have. 1 million FPS uh, or 1 million Hertz frequency on my screen, but just from the smoothness, okay? Um, so yeah, now I hope you know, I hope you understand how DPI works. Uh, I mean, I don't really know how it works, but um, you, I hope you understand the difference between in-game sense and DPI now, and uh, I hope a lot of, a lot of these myths are are um, are going away in the future. So um, this is for me.